Eastern Upper Peninsula, our biggest asset is snow and we sell snow. If there's any place in the lower 48 guaranteed snow in winter, it's going to be here. I'm Tasha Steelstra. We are at Nature's Kennel Sled Dogs in the Eastern Upper Peninsula of Michigan. We have about 150 Alaskan Husky sled dogs. So we do um, a sled dog touring business where people can come and learn to drive a dog sled or they can take a ride in the sled. And then we also have a competitive racing team that we run out of those kennels. It's different than snowmobile racing or car racing where there's a season and then you park that car for a couple months and everybody takes a vacation you're done. Where with dogs it's 365 days a year because you're caring for animals and then you're lucky enough to you know, be able to race them some of that time as well. The breed you'll see is Alaskan Husky, which is a non-registered, it's not an AKC breed. For the last few hundred years they've been bred better and better bred to be racing dogs. They're a northern breed dog. Come here you little troublemaker. So they, um, in general, they're, they're prickier. Their ears will probably stand up. They have a double thick coat, so they have an outer layer of guard ha hairs and inner downy fur, and um, generally pretty so social. Hello, yes, yes, but not a specific registered breed. And you're gonna see they look so different from each other. So this is the gang line. This is what's gonna connect us to the sled. We tie our sled off here, because once they get hooked up, they really like to run. So we have a quick release that we tie this to a pole. And then when we're ready to go, I'll pull this and then we'll be off and running. We live in an, an inside world where we don't spend a lot of time outside. And people, I think, are a little afraid to be outside sometimes. What if I get cold? What if my toes get cold? What if my fingers get cold? You know, we're not out there for days and days at a time with our guests. It's for a few hours and to get people to experience that, that magic of winter, that it's okay to push yourself a little bit to try new things. You never know what you see in yourself. You never know what you see in your kids. You know, so, so see, seeing people come back with that look of, oh, that was awesome. 